One, this is Gruesome Herzog. My first review was called Hellfest in 2018. Here's the storyline. A masked serial killer turns a horror-themed amusement park into his own personal playground, terrorizing a group of friends while the rest of the patrons believe that it is all part of the show. Directed by Gregory Plotvin, written by Seth M. Sherwood, Blair Butler, and Akella Cooper. Here's the cast. Cynthia Mercado as Jody, Stephen Conroy as the other, Amy Forsyth as Natalie, Rain Edwards as Brooke, Bex Teller Klaus as Taylor, Christian James as Quinn, Matt Mercerio as Asher, Robbie Atoll as Gavin, Courtney Dietz as Brittany, and the cast goes on. I always wanted to watch Hellfest, but I never had a chance to, and finally I was able to watch it. What an amazing film. Now, this is not your typical um, amusement park for horror. You know, you had the haunted houses, whatever. This movie is so fucking clever. You have the other as this killer just walking through the amusement park of horror and literally pick this group of people, these kids, and kill them off one by one. But the ending of this film is what really fucking flipped my lid. I'm not going to tell you. I mean, I know it's been out for a while, but I want you guys to watch this. For all you horror fans out there, this movie is totally top of the line badass. So you have a bunch of kids. Quinn, Taylor, Asher, Natalie. They have their little night in this hell fest it's called you know kids being kids having fun you know again like I told you there's a mysterious killer amongst everyone do you realize how hard that would be to even even know that's even happening parents by Tony Todd I met him quite a few years ago great guy he played the Barker he was like the announcer. He had a scene in the movie with a beheading, which we can get into a little bit. A great cast, great storyline. So basically, you're watching... Okay, the, the other slash the killer had his cool mask on. And he was like just one by one harassing these kids. Well, the one girl who was basically bribed to come along I guess she was you know Quinn had hots for her and they're on this ride and there was this power outage where all the lights went out and all you could see is like a red light and you see this guy with a mask so she's flipping out panicking going crazy thinking that it's this this killer but turns out it was a trick scene to where there's a bunch of other Employees that have that same mask. So it made you led to believe that she's going to get killed, but it was a total fuck you moment. Great job there. So there's a lot of great in and outs, up and down, kills, blood. It's a really badass story. One more thing I want to talk about is the beheading scene to where Tony Todd was giving a speech and, she, and he asked for a volunteer. Well, one of the girls volunteered but the girl that I was talking to you about seen the steel-toed shoes that this killer was wearing. She remembers the shoes and all. And he was the one that's going to be pulling the thing for the beheading. So she's flipping ape shit, going crazy. Tried to run up on the stage, but that's not what he did. It was another great, spectacular moment to where, holy shit. But what happens next... Once that scene is over, then he pushes the girl up to cut her head off, obviously, with this, I can't remember what it's called. Well, the blade went down, but it caught her in the necklace. So it almost choked her, but it didn't kill her. So I'm not going to say any more than that. This movie has a lot of surprises. It's a really fucking cool-ass movie. So definitely check it out, folks. Hellfest. 2018. It's well worth a watch. This is Gruesome Herzog. I give this film an 8.5 out of 10. I really, really enjoyed this one.
Tony Todd. Tony Todd was the best as ever. A great guy, a great actor. He really put a different little spin on this character. That being said, this is Grissom Herzog, and 